Hey there, it's me Red Knight and welcome back to Hey Day. Now today we're going to head on over to the top right hand corner. There are some diamond packages that are on offer. Now these diamond packages are actually for 50 diamonds, 130 diamonds and 275 diamonds. Now normally the cost of 50 diamonds is 240 yen for the 130 600 yen and for the 275 okay 1200 yen. Now the reason it's in yen is because I live in Japan as you know. Now the bonus thing about this is the fact that I get boosters with the actual diamond packages. So not only do I get diamonds for the same price that I would normally pay for them as well, but I'm getting some extra items. Now for booster pack number three, you're getting six five star boosters. Very nice indeed. Booster pack number two, there's two, three threes and three five stars. And for booster pack number one, there are three threes and one five star there. So in total, it's about 2000 yens worth of fees. Yeah, I'm not really going to complain about that cost. Uh, the fact that I'm getting the boosters there is very nice indeed. And if I actually turn them over, I can see the kind of boost options that are behind. Now, the my one, not so good, but the XP one could be very nice indeed. Some of the building ones can be wonderful. I don't mind getting the helpers as well. Uh, not really keen on the fishing ones down there. Some of the crop ones would be good as well. Uh, as were some of the machines, I would like those as well. Right, so those are the options. Now, if I go down to my booster at the moment, you'll see I've got two of three in storage there and three that are purchased. Now as far as I'm aware this one here and this one here are extra boosters and these are the ones that I should have that came from previous booster packs there uh, but I'm not really 100% sure on that one because I don't know yet which boosters are which but I do know this one was from a last booster pack as was this one and I think this one definitely was as well. But uh, we will see what happens as I start using these last two. Now, I've got those boosters down there. Any new boosters should go to the end. So what we're going to do is do a little bit of a purchase here. Uh, I'm tempted to actually use that other booster later for when the boat arrives and get rid of that one there. But it's only one crate, which is a shame. Uh, but at least it's for 24 hours, which is not so bad. The fishing booster over there I'm going to activate later in the week when we've got a beautiful fishing event. So let's go do it and see what happens. Right, we're going up to the first one. So I got to buy each of these booster packs. Uh, it will cost me real money and let's do it. So number one. Okay, as you can see there, I've just purchased booster pack number three. That purchase was successful. So we should get 275 diamonds and boosters down into my storage there. And the booster pack disappears because you can only make one purchase. So let's go have a look. Right, they've now added to the end. So what did I get? I got a town booster there. So 50% shorter for the next 24 hours for my personal train. Very nice. I like the look of that one. There's a beautiful crop booster there as well for tomatoes, strawberries and potatoes. There's a machine booster there for the sewing machine, the cake oven and the juice press. There's another lobster booster there, 50% bathed and uh, finished faster for 24 hours. That's okay, but not the best one. And there's also this gorgeous active booster there for XP as well. So very nice. I like the look of that one. Could use that one with the theme that we got on at the moment. Could be kind of cool. And there's another crop booster there as well. Onions, rice and lettuce. So very, very nice indeed. So one, two, three, four, five, six boosters there. Okay, I like that one. All right, let's go do the next pack. All right, let's do it again. So... Pack number two. Okay, I've just purchased the second pack there. So let's go click on the OK. And that one disappears. I get the diamonds and some more boosters added there. Yay, very nice indeed. Right, let's go have a look. So we had up to and including the crop booster that was there. So this time we got another machine booster for the candle maker, candy machine and the salad bar. Very nice indeed. There is a four star booster there for ducks. Okay. There's another one there for the personal train which is kind of cool as well there's one there for the actual seagulls on my fishing spots that would be useful uh, another one for the train as well so a lot of personal train ones this time hmm I need a town task and a Tom short nap for the next 12 hours not so beneficial 
So in total, that's now taken me up to 15 purchased and two in stock. So let's have a look. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. So 13, 14, 15. And these two should be the ones that are over and above. So that'll be about right. That's not too bad. Okay, that kind of matches very nicely. All right, the last one, let's go do it. Okay, we're going to do one more pack and that's it for this video. So let's do it. Okay, pack number three has been done for me. So all three packs purchased. Let's go see what I got. Right, they've now disappeared and it's just the regular diamonds available in the shop. Now I'm not going to do those because there's nothing special there. But let's go see what we've just gained this time. So we had the Tom last time. So we've got a lure one there for 40% faster. We've got a free helper there as well for 48 hours for Ernest. Another building one there for the town as well. And another nap one for Tom. Yeah, not so good there. So overall, I was very satisfied. There's a lot of nice boosters down there, and there's a few I can definitely use. Might have to hire Tom, though, just to reduce his nap time and get that one. So I will save those for a little bit later, because there's two good nap ones there. Maybe when I've got a long schedule break, uh, that would be very beneficial indeed. Just need to set my alarm then. So maybe a weekend could be good. Hmm. Long weekend coming up very soon. I might do that one. A lot of town ones there, which is very beneficial this time so it seems to be very town heavy this time and also a lot of their boosters for the fishing area as well so very fishing focused a few crop ones in there so again very very nice indeed okay so uh, at least i now know which boosters are which and i believe these two here are the boosters i need to use to take my stories down to uh, zero for extra items now hey there i still wish that you would let me see which boosters are purchased versus which ones are not because it is actually very challenging i kind of like the line that you've got here for the last purchase booster if i could have a separated little line just between the two lots of boosters that would make it very easy to see so maybe boosters on the left are then stopped by a single line then boosters on the right are after the line so boosters on the left could be the ones that are part of the three uh, and i pay extra diamonds to keep and boosters on the right are the boosters that i've purchased that i would keep without losing hmm or maybe with my idea of changing the colors you did make them more beautiful but you know what i want please make it a little bit simpler the user interface definitely needs to change uh, a user interface for the boosters i think is definitely something that needs to be looked at in 2019 especially now that the valley is done and maybe before you start tweaking that or think about this for later okay well that's me red signing off now i hope you like my booster video hope your boosters were as good as this one remember it is an option it's down to you if you decide to purchase them or not if you are someone who likes to buy diamonds they are available within the shop but why not wait till you get booster packages or deco packages and then it's a little bit more beneficial well at least i think so anyway but either way see you next time take care and good designing bye now